In our Catholic history and experience, there are so many men and women whose lives continue to inspire us. Let me tell you about one, a Vietnamese priest named Francis Xavier Nguyen Van Thuan. He was appointed Archbishop of Saigon back in the 70s, 1970s, and on his way there, he was captured and imprisoned by the communists. He spent 13 years in prison and eight or nine of those years in isolation. Nonetheless, this amazing bishop, who could not have any real contact with his people, found ways to smuggle out little messages of hope and joy to his people written on scraps of paper and would remind them of the gospel of Jesus Christ. One thousand and one of those messages during his time. Listen to an example right here. You should always be joyful the road of hope does not allow for traveling in sadness. It is the road that restores joy. Remember, he's writing that from prison. Here's another one. Complaining is a highly contagious epidemic whose chief symptoms are pessimism, loss of interior peace, doubt, and a decrease in the zeal which comes from being unified with God. Get a hold of the little book, The Road of Hope, A Gospel from Prison, and I assure you, you will be inspired. In just in May of 2017, Pope Francis has declared this priest venerable, just like Nelson Baker, on their way to canonization.